guys welcome back to my channel i'm bringing you guys a hair review video no it's been a while since i've done one of these so i think you guys should appreciate this one because i took a long break from doing these so i'm bringing you back another one so today's video is sponsored by love me hair they sent me this beautiful unit and i literally did the quickest install on this unit little to no customization at all like almost zero so guys if you are interested in seeing my little quick installation and of course getting more information on this hair then you want to go ahead and stay tuned keep on watching guys guys you know we're always going to start off with the contents of your box so you know love me hair always has some nice packaging but you do get your nice wig cap you get a user guide that just goes over like how to take care of your wig and all that stuff you get a band a rat tail comb and your edge brush now this is the unit this is their brown highlight fun me curly glueless 5x5 lace closure wig this is what the lace is looking like i don't believe that it's an hd lace but yeah this is the wig construction and it's a very basic wig construction nothing to it but this is the unit nice and bouncy and shiny it's looking good so far so i'm just gonna go ahead and throw my hair in my wig cap so this is how i usually wear my hair all day every day all week so i just went ahead and brushed out my edges in the front i don't plan on like gluing the whole thing down so i'm just taking away the front parts of my edges and then just catching up my hair and putting it in my very very trusty wig cap i swear this wig cap is under all my wigs all the time so first things first putting on that unit and just seeing how it fits on my head and it actually fit pretty good now it did come with a dedicated side part so i went ahead and brushed that out because i wouldn't even wear my side parts on that side anyways that's not my good side so minimal construction i lied minimal customization literally i plucked this unit on my head and it's really just to break up that straight across hairline super super minimal literally this was all the hair that i plucked from this after brushing it out barely anything but the hairline was good enough for me so hey i could work with it now i was trying to figure out do i want a middle part or do i want a side part i'm not a hundred percent sure yet but guys the most important part to getting a nice flat install get the baby hairs out your face go ahead and just sleek it back with your hot comb your hot comb is your best friend now we know it burns sometimes and she can burn you but you need it and then went in with my um contour shade and just tinted the front of that lace you know just so it matches i usually go for a darker shade than my actual um you know foundation shade no my glue plopped all over my forehead and i just went in with the excess and put that layer on my forehead then i went in with a second layer um just two light layers of glue for this install and you want to make sure that it dries clear before you go ahead and place your wig on top now when you do you want to use that rat tail comb and push it into your skin it only helps the lace melt that much better so you definitely want to go ahead and do that once it pushes in it feels a little sturdy i then cut off that excess lace go in with my wig dealer spray and just melt the sides guys i only put glue in the middle of my forehead so i didn't want glue to touch where my edges were which is why i went in with my spray and boom bang baby yeah that's what it's looking like very very quick and simple right so onto the defining the curls just using my spray bottle with some water and defining the, the curls of the hair no i did that obviously on both sides what i do on one side i do on the other and this is how she's looking already you know define it more if you need to go in again with that hot comb again if you need to she's your friend she bites she burns but she is your friend and just get it super flat 
flat as possible neat as possible because that's what we want no when it comes to adding layers to your hair i always think this step is so important because it just helps to frame your face when your wig is one length it just falls flat on your face and you want it when it dries even if it's any texture here you want it to frame your face to the best possible shape now after i cut layers i did the most minimal baby hairs i've probably ever done went in with my got to be gel when it was a little bit tacky just start forming those baby hairs super minimal super super minimal all right guys that's it we have come to the end of this video didn't i tell you guys that it was a really quick install little to no customization i was not kidding like i barely did anything but guys that is really it for this video i mean it is 1 a.m in the morning i'm so tired i barely even wanted to film this video but i did the bare minimum on this wig and it came out super cute so it's giving a wig for the beginners it's giving beginner friendly wig so you guys should definitely check it out you already know all the information will be in my description bar below go ahead and check that out click the direct link if you want the direct hair and there will be a link that will bring you to their website of course you can go ahead and browse if you like guys, any other um details that you guys need it will be in my description bar below just go ahead and read that i just want to say thank you again to love me here for sponsoring today's video guys thank you again so much for your support go ahead and like comment share and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys Thank you.